I just want to start with a sincere congratulations. Uh, the movie's fantastic. Thank you. Um, uh, before I have a lot of questions, but before we jump into it, Chris, I just have to ask you: When do I get to see Pool Man? Man, I you know I want to show Pool Man off. I don't know. I, firstly, I have to sell the film. I have to find someone who wants to distribute the film. So, um, Neon A twenty four. I'm looking at you. Um, but soon, hopefully soon. I love my film. It makes me giggle. And a lot of people seem to giggle when they watch it. And uh, I'm very proud of it. Very, very, very proud of it. I can't wait to see it. I know. I'm going to set up a screening because it looks like it, it, it's going to be a while before maybe it hits theaters. But uh, I'll set up a screening invite. Everyone in the world. That's cool. Don't be afraid to send one my way. Now I'm jumping into why I get to talk to you guys. How happy you guys went around the world to promote the con to promote this movie at Comic Con. You went to Brazil. You've been to San Diego. How happy are you that the movie is awesome? Dude, <laughs> Dude I like I like great. your steez, man. I like great your steez. question. Yeah. <laughs> and this this question. is coming from a guy with like you know he's he's got the Back to the Future car in oh, the yeah. backdrop. He's got Transformer doll yeah. in the backdrop. He's got Charlie Brown. Uh. It certainly sucks when a movie sucks. Um, this one doesn't fall into that category, thank God. What was really fun, I have to say, is going to South by Southwest, I, I had never been to that Paramount Theater, and that Paramount Theater is such an incredible venue because it's so small, it's so tight, it's so cavernous that there's like no chance for any energy to dissipate. And this film is specifically made... You know, this is made for audiences. It's made for film goers. It's made to be seen in the theater. It's made to be shared. So to be able to be in that um, in that uh, environment, to feel the energy go around, to feel people laugh, to gasp, to cry, to all of it was really, really exciting. One of the things about the film, well, one of the many things, it's really funny. The action is well staged and um, you care about the characters. Uh, so I'm just curious for this was not the question I was going to I was going with, but I'm curious for, for both of you. What are you actually most excited for people to see? Because there's so many good things in this movie. Oh, for gosh. me, it's the fact that there are a lot of practical effects in it. So the, a lot of it to me feels like films that I grew up watching, like uh, Goonies or uh, I don't know, really anything. Willow, Princess Bride. There's a lot of real in this. And I think in an age of so much commuter graphics, and certainly we have a bunch of that in this, there are a lot of scenes that employ practical old fashioned craftsmanship, um, animatronics and, and, and stuff that, you know, we haven't really seen on film in a long time. And I think that's really exciting. Yeah, I'm with him on that, you know, to be fair, like, it's just so awesome, you know, Legacy did such a wonderful job, you know, creating all of these creatures. And I think that their debut is everything to me. Um, and it's you can just tell the difference. I mean, I, I can't put my finger on it, but I can tell the difference between, you know, it's a mixture between digital and animatronic. But you could see that there is a three dimensional, you know, robotic movement behind all of it. And I think that there's something really cool about that. I don't know. I think the creatures, it's just all about the creatures for me. And I just can't wait for all the, 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 the Easter eggs to kind of like shine through. I have to wrap with you already. I'm just going to say a sincere congrats. And I really do want this to be a big hit so you guys can do more. Aww, thank you. So thank you. That's awesome. It.